So what's the deal? Well, if you've ever gone to the Philippines, Thailand, or any other Asian country, you will know just how much of a delicacy you are. <whistles> But in all seriousness, there is a lot of Asian women who prefer to date white guys. You're probably thinking to yourself, why is this important and why do a video about this? Yep, it's a good point and to be honest, I was thinking the same thing. However, there are a lot of guys who go over to Asia and get into all kinds of problems, so it's good to know the truth and know where you stand so you don't fall into any traps. The first reason is because of bad experiences from ex-boyfriends. I've heard this a lot over the years, and perhaps you have too. Typically the scenario is an Asian woman is dating somebody from her own country and then she is treated poorly and therefore turns to foreigners as she believes a relationship experience with a foreigner will be much better. There is a lot more to this which touches upon cheating and affairs but I must say this happens globally. You may have heard of men having mistresses which can be common in some cultures. Amazingly there's even data about what countries cheat the most on average so it's no surprise that some Asian women prefer to date expats. A lot of women that I've interviewed on this channel previously mentioned that they feel that Westerners are more open. Take a listen to this interview which talks about this. And looking at this Western culture, men have a certain openness. Mm. Uh, the thing is what, what I notice is with Asian men, for example, they are more a little bit captivated by the conservative culture. They have a certain expectation. For example, a Western man allows me to be me, allows me to be open. The elephant in the room is money and opportunities for the future. Many foreigners who go to Southeast Asia are considered rich. In some Southeast Asian countries, having a monthly income of $1,000 is considered very wealthy. I did some research about the average wage in Asia, and it does fluctuate from country to country and profession to profession. However, I found that on average, it is approximately $200 a month, which means that you have five times as much money as the locals if you have $1,000. To put this in perspective, imagine living in your home country or even your hometown with five times the amount of money that the average worker makes. So it's clear to see the attraction from a financial point of view, but it's not only about the money, it's also about the future opportunities. Life can be very difficult in Southeast Asia, and so with more opportunities and higher wages overseas, some singletons are also attracted to the opportunity. One reason that's never spoken about why some Asian women are interested in dating white men and foreign men is due to their expectations. Expectations. I saw this a lot in the Philippines, but also in many Southeast Asian countries. For example, in the Philippines, some generations grow up with the idea of Prince Charming, and Prince Charming is often a white guy from a far distant land. This is thanks to films by Disney and the like. But this is not all. Expectations can also be related to more adult conversations. For instance, some Asian women hear stories and rumours about foreigners being bigger and better in the bedroom. Take a listen to this clip and tell me what you think. White men perform better in the bedroom. This is not about the extra sexual performance. It's about a guy's attitude when it comes to giving his woman pleasure. White men are likely to make things hot before the main course starts, but a lot of Asian men are used to being served by Asian women in bed, so they don't try very hard. And the result is many Asian girls prefer dating white men instead. I'm not suggesting that anything is true, but what I'm saying is that some do prefer a unique experience, so to speak. I've tried to make this as YouTube friendly as I can, but I think you get the point here. Now, if we wanted to get technical, we could say that in terms of biology, racial diversion creates healthier offspring. There is also the psychological side, which talks about attraction to difference. However, I believe that the reason why so many Asian women prefer to date foreigners is a mixture of all of these reasons, but why do you think that some Asian women love dating white guys? 